Hi, this is Peter with Simvana, and today's topic is keeping your electrical system to yourself. And what I'm talking about is an anesthesia safety precaution that often gets ignored or overlooked. So I'm going to jump into Simvana and I'll show you exactly what I'm talking about and why it's so important. We are looking at the back of the anesthesia machine, and as you can see, we have a case in progress. But what I would like you to look at is the electrical the auxiliary electrical outlets on the back of the machine here because one of the outlets circuit breaker is tripped and I can't re-engage it. So I would like to take a look at what is plugged in and it appears that someone has plugged an electrocautery unit into our outlets. Now in Simbana we've modeled the electrical characteristics of all of the devices, all the electrical devices in the room as well as all of the outlets. So if you plug a device into an outlet that's not rated to handle that kind of power, it's going to trip the breaker and you'll lose power to the device. So what we need to do in this case is unplug the electric cautery unit, we'll ask the circulator to plug it into another outlet somewhere, and we can re-engage our circuit breaker. So it's extremely important that you never allow anyone to plug any devices other than anesthesia monitors or anesthesia devices into the back of your machine. And I'm gonna show you one other reason why that's important is if we disconnect our anesthesia machine from power, you'll hear an alarm that lets us know that we're using our backup battery system. And normally we should have about 20 to 30 minutes of power to our anesthesia machine. However, if other devices are plugged into the back of our anesthesia machine, that's going to decrease the amount of power that we have to supply anesthesia, to use our ventilator, to use our monitors, and that could present a safety risk to our patient. If you'd like to see more anesthesia tips, then be sure to click like, subscribe, and hit the bell icon, and I'll see you in the next video. Thanks so much.